So, now we drive with these 4955 within our factory. It's not that smooth <laughs> because it does have a lot of power. That's a big job. It is. To fill, to fill the tire with the, the sufficient amount of uh, air, it only needs uh, one sack or less than <laughs> one sack. So, uh, the next station is our rims. There are, I think we will have two trucks coming, semis, coming to the factory each day and bringing stuff like rims and uh, equipment or whatever and these tractors will go a longer way a longer distance within Europe and here's the load station ah that's quite a big There's all kinds here. They're, every single tractor is different. Every single tractor is different. If you are standing on the line and you want to wait, the two tractors come out of the line who are very similar to each other and do not have any difference. You have to wait up to eight years. So many different uh, configurations we do have. Wow. like the sound of the tractor? <laughs> it's one of the best parts. No, not at all. Oh. <laughs> that was a different... I wasn't expecting them. <laughs> and the 80-20 rule, 80% of the failures are sitting behind, 20 centimeters behind the steering wheel. <laughs> Sometimes I wish that was not true, but it always is. It is, all the time. <laughs> so I, I love these. Uh, yeah. of that machine is unbelievable. Woo! It's, Except the power is instant. It is, it is. Well, there's uh, these 
quick responsiveness of the angle. But what you can't see is outside of the what is it called uh, the exhaust pipe. Yeah, these black smoke. Maybe it's not that nice to inhale it, yeah. but it looks cool. It is, yeah, it is. <laughs> Smoky show. So how old is this tractor? Well, that's, this tractor was built in uh, the late 80s, 1989, something like that. I was born in 1988. Well, I was the same uh, day. <laughs> and it does have 229 horsepower. Woo! It does have about... 500 hours on this clock. That's not too, not too much. Not too much. And it works uh, pretty far. Has this tractor always been with John Deere, or is it one that you guys got back from a customer? And we got it back from a customer. A colleague of mine was doing a deal with a customer in the north of Germany and saw this tractor. And told me from this of this tractor, so I sent them a truck and uh, we hold it to the factory. In the next couple of years, we want to make out of it a brand new tractor yeah. and uh, put in auto track controller, ISO bus uh, harness, and all that stuff to show that it is possible to make out of an old tractor a new one with a lot of high tech. So we check the speed. Should go above 30k. Yeah. But the tractor can't can only. It can't can even go 30k. Yeah. <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> And on our campus, we have a museum, which is our next stop, and it's here. If we are lucky, we can stop. <laughs> and the tractor will not fit in the museum, so we have to stop here. Oh, let it run. Okay. What's it called? Red mounts. Mm -hmm. And here we could use even what is called uh, Apple CarPlay. Yeah. Yeah, that works here pretty fine. So uh. that's the radio, or what is it called, the uh, multimedia system. A function which gives me a nice message <laughs> in the back and then the uh, what is called uh, flags. And that's yeah. pretty fine in two different ways a smoother one and a really bigger one. That <laughs> is giving you a lot of comfort. So to have everything better in place, I can go around with my seat. See that? <laughs> we have here the extension so that I could fit in a different display. Uh -huh. That one is called Command Pro Joystick. I can have here different settings for the aggressiveness, the acceleration, and everything I want to do. So I've just started. I can configure the whole system like a smartphone oh, everything you can see here on the screen is adjustable i can have that display on this display and can switch so this is auto track uh -huh. so that i can use a satellite yeah and you will hear from time to time if i cross these lines there's a <laughs> saying me you can push the button and it will go in this direction so what we can do as well is uh, having, for instance, a camera that I can see what's behind me. Oh. Yeah. So that is in the front, uh -huh. and that is in the back. Oh, that's so yeah. cool! It is, and this one does have a fish eye so that I can see what's around the corner. Everything. If I go inside a, a junction, a conjunction yeah. or whatever, I can see it. And that, that very, that's very helpful. And I can combine it with a trigger function. So if I choose to go backwards, mm -hmm. I can sell the camera, give me the picture at the back. 
So we have here a transmission which is called EIVT, E out of power, EIVT. And uh, we removed the hydros. Mm -hmm. And uh, instead of the hydros, we have electric motors. And our <laughs> is already a lot smoother. <laughs> it is. And so actually, the sound in here, that's the air conditioning. It is only. It's not the tractor. <laughs> it is, right. And if you compare it to this tractor you see here, that one was built in 1992 and it was a one million tractor which came out of the factory. So it does have a different painting. We call it Ford Capri Green Metallic. Oh yeah, look at that! And it's the only one and it's really brand new. It does have maybe 35 hours on this block. <laughs> it's very smooth shifting. Ah, yes. And the acceleration is uh, instantaneous. It is. To give you a quick impression of that, although it's cold, uh -huh. that's the speed we are actually going. And now we have. Well, I can't go uh, faster here in the factory, yeah. but what I can tell you if you stand in front of traffic lights and you push the pedal to the metal, it can keep up with a modern car. So <laughs> you are not in a city. You are not a. Uh, yeah, you are not yeah. blocking the, the traffic. That was so smooth. That was really comfortable. It is. I, yeah, and you can see the, the uh, hood in front of you. It's very. It does have a waist. Yeah. Uh, like a waist. So the uh, overall view. The visibility, from, from my perspective as a driver, is brilliant. Yeah, you can see everything. Yeah. I mean, I, yeah. I can I can see the front three point from here. I can see everything. And the good thing is, although this tractor offers or provides 460 horsepower, it feels like an 80 horsepower tractor from here. Yeah. And you can see everything. It's so controllable. So it is. It, 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 the easiest thing in the world. Not that big anymore from this perspective. <laughs> You're right. I oh, like these the, the cabless, operator yeah. stations. Yeah, it just looks cool. It's like a convertible car. It is. It's just cool. Is it? Yeah, a convertible. We call it open operator station. Kick it to the left side, and what is a tractor? He's reversing. And it does its thing for you. Yeah, it does. <laughs> now I want to go forward. I have to kick it to the left side. Once okay. again, and it's and changing direction. And you didn't even press the brakes. No, I do not need that. <laughs> um, so now my foot is on the gas, but I can go away and use that one here to uh, dial in the speed I want to go. It's only with the thumb. And just nudge it. Yeah, just boop. If I would do this one here, it's going to speed control, cruise control. Uh -huh. I can change the speed of of it. I have three different uh, cruise controls on this tractor on this tractor and it's really nice and it's so comfy so that is the second one i switch it off go to the second one dial in maybe whatever 20k and if i go here it keeps the speed and now i would assume that would be for farmers that are doing Maybe different things, or maybe they've got yeah. you know one set, set it for the road, yes. set it for the field, set it for your headlands, or something like that. Something like around. that. Normally, you wouldn't do anything. You would program the tractor. The tractor is going autom autom Cause autonomous. Because it can just do yeah. that. <laughs> it's so sophisticated from the technique point. A thick thousand four hundred with one hundred horsepower. It was brand new, and it was the first tractor produced with these full frame design so all the components engine oil pan are not uh, carrying weight or load mm -hmm. it's carried by the frame so it's protecting the engine the transmission everything and that makes this tractor very li reliable this tractor does have about 35 horsepower on its clock not more and it works like on the first day <laughs> although it's over 30 years old as am I Give it a try. Have <laughs> <laughs> your seat. As a transmission, you can see that we had an earlier times 
instead of these uh, orange nobles, we have red one, we had red one, we changed that. Yeah. So if you sit on the tractor, everything which is yellow does have to do with the power takeoff, PTO. Everything which is orange today has to do something with the uh, transmission. Okay. So power port, we choose our range, our group, this is C for instance. This one is, are the speeds. I can shift them under load. Mm -hmm. And here I can change direction. So we would go reverse. It's very smooth, although the tractor does have its age. And now I can accelerate. <laughs> you can accelerate backwards. Mm. It is very easy. <laughs> change direction. Shift to a bigger group. And now we will go into the factory. You heard, hear the sound? Everything is working. It's so smooth. It's, yeah, it's really, really smooth. It is. Ooh. Although it's 30 years old. And she moves. <laughs> and that one is going at much per hour. Yeah. But I can't know. I do not know if it's going for uh, feels a little bit. It feels, it feels like we're going a lot faster than that. Yeah, I think. <laughs> So it was the last tractor, it was the, the one million tractor, as I told you, and therefore we have these one million directly <laughs> on the window. We could even open the window. Yeah. <laughs> it's so shiny and good looking, that one. And all the guys seeing that tractor going around, Everyone looks. I love that machine. <laughs> yeah, and uh, in the next couple of months, we will produce the two million tractor, and I guess we will put that in the John Deere forum in the next month as well, if it is built. So we were here just a month late. Yeah. <laughs> or a month early. Right now we have produced on this campus 1.99 million tractors. So it will not take that much time <laughs> to have this 2 million tractors. And how many tractors did you say you make every day? About 200 tractors each day. <laughs> so it needs about 3 to 4 minutes to get a new tractor from the line. So we have two shifts right now. And in each shift, yeah, we have a... Uh, First shift I get 150 tractors and then in the second shift, which is a bit slower, 50, 60 tractors. So in That's this insane. year we produce about 40,000 tractors on this campus. Last year it was about 35,000 and the year before 28,500. So there's a so consistent. great <laughs> demand of new John Deere tractors coming out of the John Deere factory here in mm -hmm. Mama which is the biggest factory outside uh, North America from from here. It is, it is huge. Uh, yeah. we've, we've been driving around for about an hour now and I'm pretty sure we haven't even covered half the place yet. All right. You like the machine? Like the machine. There's no air conditioning in this one though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that you can feel, uh, yeah, the heat. So evidently there is air conditioning. We just yeah. didn't have it on. <laughs> yeah, to make it even more authentic. So it feels better. Yeah. It is. It's, it's a very lovely one. 